on x side x y is produced to point p if the y q bisects z y p find x y q and reflex of q y p so let's do it so px is a line and pyq plus qyz plus zyx forms a linear pair all are equal to 180 degree so we can find out angle pyz so let's do it angle pyq plus angle qyz plus angle zyx equal to 180 degree because of linear pair and then x y z is equal to 64 degree and then p y q plus q y z is equal to angle p y z isn't it and then p y z is made up of two angles angle p y q and angle q y z both Together we form PYZ plus angle XYZ which is equal to 64 degree that's given to us. So angle PYZ is 180 degree minus 64 which is equal to 116 degree. Ray YQ bisects the angle PYZ that means angle PYQ is equal to angle zyq bisect means to divide anything into two equal parts so ray yq divides angle pyz into two equal parts hence pyq is equal to angle qyz so can i write angle pyz as angle pyq plus angle qyz which is equal to 116 degree because angle PYZ is made up of two angles PYQ and QYZ and the summation is equal to 116 degree and we know PYQ is equal to QYZ so can I write QYZ in place of angle PYQ so twice of angle QYZ is equal to 116 degree. So angle QYZ is equal to 116 degree divided by 2, which is equal to 58 degrees. So angle QYZ is equal to 58 degree. Angle XYQ is equal to angle XYZ plus angle QYZ. Angle XYZ. Is 64 degree and angle z by q is equal to 58 degree 64 degree plus 58 degree is 122 degrees so let's find now let's find out reflex of angle q y q and remember how to find out reflex of any angle 360 degree minus angle q y p 360 degree minus QYP is equal to QYZ and QYZ is equal to 58 degree. QYP is also equal to 58 degree. So 360 degree minus 58 degree is 302 degree. So this brings us to an end of this question. Let's do a quick recap. Angle XYZ is 64 degree, Y2 bisects the angle PYZ. So we found out PYZ by a linear pair, 180 degree minus 64 is 116 degree. Now YQ bisects the angle PYZ, bisect means to divide anything into two equal parts. YQ divides the angle PYZ into two equal parts. That means PYQ is equal to angle QYZ. 
Now P Y Z is 160 degree. So P Y Z is equal to P Y Q plus Q Y Z, and that's how we find out Q Y Z. So our Q Y Z and P Y Q are equal to 58 degree. Angle X Y Q is summation of angle X Y Z plus Z Y Q. Substitute the values. Reflex of angle Q Y P is 360 minus angle. 360 minus 58 degrees, 302 degree. A quick recap, but if you still have any doubt or problem, I recommend you to re-watch this video. And any doubts, let me know in the comments.